for the Culture presents Gwendolyn B. Bennett, writer, poet, artist. Gwendolyn Bennett was born on July 8, 1902 in Giddings, Texas. A versatile artist, poet, writer, and teacher, she was very active in the African American arts community in Harlem, along with being one of the most revered yet overlooked artists of the Harlem Renaissance literary movement of the 1920s. Bennett attended Columbia University and the Pratt Institute. At Columbia, she became one of the charter members of the Rho chapter of Delta Sigma Theta Sorority Incorporated. Bennett was best known for the poetry and writing that she produced because it had a direct influence on the soul of the Harlem Renaissance, emphasizing racial pride and African values such as music and dance. One of her most influential poems entitled Fantasy not only accentuated the racial pride of the African Americans, but for women in general, by shining light on possibilities considered unattainable for women during this time. Bennett co-founded the short-lived literary journal Fire, along with Langston Hughes and Richard Nugent. She served as an editor for the single edition along with Zora Neale Hurston, John Davis, and Aaron Douglas, a publication that is now reportedly regarded in some circles as a key cultural movement of the Harlem Renaissance. Bennett also shared a romantic vision of being African, which she expressed through one of her more famous works of poetry entitled, To a Dark Girl, creating an empowering aspect to African-American women features, Bennett's imagery and comparisons to Queens continues to be used to encourage African-American women in embracing their blackness. Gwendolyn B. Bennett, we salute you. You did it for the culture. <laughs>